Marcus, at what point did becoming a special team superstar become a thing for you? No, it, it was it was fun, man. The coaches gave me the opportunity to go out and play, and you know, I have an easy job: run down and and go hit the guy. And Rico puts in the air for like 20 seconds, so it makes it easy. <laughs> Walk us through the fumble recovery play. What'd you see on that, and uh, how did that play transpire? The way I remember it was I was going down, I saw the returner point, and I was assuming, like, oh, stay away, and I heard the ball hit a pad. Oh, so I was like, oh, a fumble, or, or he missed it, and he, I saw the ball bounce in front of me, so I just went and tried to go grab it. That's pretty much it. You make it sound pretty simple, but there's clearly some technique to this, <laughs> no, like no. to break down and make a tackle, especially when, you know, a punt returner is near the goal line. So walk us through that process. When you beat your guy around the edge, at what point, you know, do you have to break down and start thinking about stuff like that? Well, in practice, we, we practice long strides, short strides. So you, you get into your lifting phase, and you're going. And then when you get about five yards of the person, you start breaking down, ready for them to make a move. But since Rico times it up so perfectly, I can literally jog down there and tackle the guy. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough. What does the McKenzie name in BYU football mean to you? I mean, it's, it's my last name. It's fun to represent it on the field, and I'm, I'm grateful for it. You know, all the people that sacrificed everything for me to get here, you know, I'm so grateful. What do you say is the, is the number one lesson you've learned through the first two games of the season as a younger player? Um, when you have the opportunity, take it. I, I think it's as simple as that. When you have the opportunity, go take it and, and leave it all out on the field, have no regrets. And what, in your opinion, what was the biggest difference from this team between week one and week two in the improvement? Um, all around, we, we just wanted it more. Every time we play, we learn something, we correct it, <clears throat> and we just want to come out and, and ball out and show people what we got. What's it like to celebrate in front of a raucous Lavelle Edwards Stadium after you make a big tackle or you recover a fumble? It's fun. It's fun because like now you can celebrate. And you, you think about it on the sideline. Uh, I'll say to myself, okay, when I tackle him, am I going to go like this? Am I going like this? <laughs> you know, all the different things. But, no, it, it's fun. The fans make the environment awesome. So, yeah. All right, what's next for you, man? Where, where do you go from here? Because you're off to a great start. Back to the film room. Back to practice and getting better, correcting all the mistakes. Okay. Well, Arkansas next week. We wish you the best of luck pushing forward. Stay healthy, and we'll talk again soon. Yes, sir. Thank you, guys.